asohiru abatinu alaru waba iwa lo pamo iwa lo bara jade ye alara gba yi da ni yo ara to wo da sa lo den da eyi to ni ka wa ma fe we da la den fi da iwa sha lo ni kokoro gbogbo emi ni ni yo fa si kuru ni wo si kuru ni wo ni nse mo ru ko fa ya ku re la fi se ti wa ewe je hu be eyi to da fun wa la de gojule eyi to ni ka lo la de nlo oba nla da fun ma je kan sise oba to ri gogo e da ta ori iwo lo ba ta n ba se lodo re if your food is poisoned or your drink you are going to discover if someone poison your food or your drink you are going to discover it if it is food if there is a poison in your food the food is going to hurt very hot that you will not be able to eat it even when you hold it when you hold the plate of the food is going to hurt abnormal you understand so this thing is telling you that there is a poison in that food that you should stay away from it if the if the poison is in your drink maybe you are you are kind of person that like beer you understand good that bo go back all those beers you understand and if the if poison is in that drink when you hold the bottle is going to break <laughs> the bottle is going to break or maybe they put poison in your glass cup of water right whenever you hold the glass cup is going to break <laughs> uh, there is a power in nature hmm? what you need is sodom apple this is sodom apple it's like i've explained something like this before but this one is different the reason why i want to share this with you is that yesterday i did this for someone and the I feel like to share it with you guys. So, this Sodom apple. That is the material. Sodom apple. You need war gecko. War gecko. And you need a bunch of alligator pepper. Hmm? When you try this tip, believe me, whenever they try to poison you, in your food, or your drink you are going to discover it believe me by the grace of almighty god <laughs> most especially those uh taros uh, men or women you need this you need this mm? everybody need it too you understand but i always want those taros that you should be you should be a uh, careful of friends you understand and they stop drinking uh, alcoholic with your friends so that they will not poison you so if you watch this video if you want to do it you are free to do it don't call me before you do it you can do it without my knowledge if you know this sodom apple if you know it <clears throat> then go ahead and do it and uh, by the grace of almighty god we share me a good testimony Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are watching me today. My name is Dr. Mutu, or Latibu, you also know as Baby Winge. Uh, this is your first time here. Everything I do here is to share spiritual tip, just like the one that you want to watch today. And if you find this video very interesting, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And make sure that you turn on the notification bell. So whenever I upload video like this, you'll be the first person to watch. And uh, if you need more of my videos, you are free to go back to my previous video. You will see a lot of videos there that can help your spiritual life. And if you don't understand, you are free to call me on the 07 You message me on WhatsApp. 7 As you see from the title, today I want to explain how to use Sodom Apple and the word Gecko. 
and one bunch of alligator pepper hmm? to uh, see if there is a poison in your food or there is a poison in your drink. Believe me, by the grace of Almighty God, if there, if there is a poison in your food, the food is going to hurt. It's going to over hurt. Over hurt. So whenever you use that your hand to touch that food, the uh, plate is going to break. The food is going to break. So this thing is telling you that there is a poison in that food. Are you with me? So if there is a poison in your drink, in your drink, whenever you, you hold the drink, the bottle is going to break. The bottle is going to break. And if, the, if it is unbreakable cup or something that's maybe plastic rubber, when you hold it, it is going to hurt. It's going to over hurt. You understand? So what you need is Sodoma pool and uh, what they cook, and one bunch of alligator pepper. Are you with me? So if you want to do this, anywhere you find this Sodoma pool, you are not allowed to cut it anyhow. Are you with me? So whenever you see this Sodom apple on its tree, you go straight to there. You understand? And you will hold it. You will hold it. Don't cut it yet. You will hold it. You will now press it. You will press it the way that the Sodom apple, this seed, we burst. You understand? You must hold it on the tree and you burst it you hold it very well. So when the Sodom apple, when it bursts, you are going to cut it then. Are you with me? So when you cut it, you take it home. So when you get when you get home, you look for war gecko. War gecko. You are not going to kill this. You will you will catch it live. Are you with me? Live. And uh, you must not allow it to, to cut. Mm? You must make sure that you get this work gecko complete. So you are going to, you can use your hand to, to give enough of space in this Sodom apple. So you are going to put the work gecko inside this Sodom apple. Have you done that? So you are not going to put alligator pepper, a bunch of alligator pepper in you. Put it inside the same this Sodom, Sodom apple. So you will hold it. So you are going to set a pot. You can use a local pot on the fire. You leave it there at least for 10 to 20 minutes. You will allow the pot to red, to hot very well. Then after that, you are going to place this on that pot. You offer it. You allow it to burn and you grind it to, to powder. You allow it to burn completely and you grind it to a powder. You understand? Then after that, you can share this powder with many people. You can do it for your, for your children. You can do it for your wife. You can do it for any work. You understand? So get a new razor blade. If you are not a professional, if you know how to do institution, if you don't know how to do it, please, you better take it to someone that will do it for you. Please don't use razor blade to design your hand. Are you with me? So if you don't know how to do it, please, you better take it to someone that can help you to do it. Are you with me? So you are going to get a new race of blade. You make a station around your uh, wrist like this here. You make a station. The first hand and the second hand. So you are going to apply the powder. You apply it all over the mark, you understand? But if you want to, if you want to use the powder, maybe you want to use it for yourself, you are going to cut out of this, this powder. So do not use that blood, uh, the blood to touch the other powder. Remove small out of the powder. You know that this is your home. You understand? If you want to do it for your wife, you remove small out of the powder. This is your wife. You understand? So you must use the one that you use your hand to touch. You must use it all for your own. And if the powder is, is too much somehow, you treat it away. You don't have anything to do with your own again. So that is how to do it and that is how to use it. If this video is very interesting, please don't forget to like this video. 
you comment and uh, you share this video if you like this video it will encourage me to bring another one you understand <clears throat> yeah you know this video if you know that this video help you a lot there is a way you can also help me by like this video you comment you understand thank you is enough i will appreciate it so that is how to do it and that is how to use it if you have any question to ask me uh, you are free to message me uh, or you drop a, a comment under this video so i'll get back to you but if you have something to discuss with me in a professional level you can call me on a 070 or you message me on whatsapp 090 533 2747 so that is how to do it I want fish every I want